Good morning, everyone. This is Patrick coming back from the Mass Store and Knife Shop doing another review. Today, I'm going to take a look at the Iona V2. Obviously, V2 might stand for version 2, which it is. Let's take it out of the box, take a look at it. As always, nice boxing, nice packaging. These guys always look for everything. There we go. That's what it looks like. This particular model, version 2, is going to be something they redesigned. Basically, they want to give you beefier blade they want to give you a little bit longer handle uh, they wanted this to become something that was used more of an outdoors tool everyday carry obviously edc like everything they make but they've done some other designs not just this beefy part here the longer handle even this liner lock they made this a little raised the whole purpose was if you're wearing gloves in the outdoors you can still find that and push it over and close it the change on the opening system on this is a little bit different there's no flipper it's simply a thumb stud but the action on here is super smooth. It is a washer on the pivot, but it still it functions just like as if it had ball bearings in it. It's really, really super smooth. I love the action on this guy. This particular one is going to come in with a green canvas micarta. We're also carrying this second one with a linen micarta black. You can see how beautiful that is right there. That's gorgeous. A little bit smoother. So if you're looking for a little bit more texture, you want the green micarta, uh, more EDC, probably go with the black. This particular knife's come with MagnaCut steel, which we're going to cover a little bit about that in a minute. Like all the rest of their knives, this particular one's coming with a steel wire clip. It is reversible. You can flip it over and we'll do that for you in the shop. If you get one with us and you're going to be a left-hand drawer, you just like pulling it out of the left side pocket. We'll do that for you. One of the things I found in the boxes here, which is kind of cool, Pretty rare, but they put a second clip in there. If you're not into the wire clip, they've got this clip in the box. And we can switch that out for you. You can do it yourself. Nice little addition to this particular style of knife. I will say that the specs on this are pretty simple. We will have the specs, pricing, and links to purchase this down below in the description. So if you don't catch anything right away, drop below and take a look at it. The weight on these guys is pretty basic, 3.4 ounces. So it's coming in at something medium weight. I think you like it when it's in your pocket. It's not going to be overly weighted to make it feel like pulling you down, but it's not going to be so light you won't use it in the outdoors. Lengthwise, we'll take a peek at that. Tip, pretty typical length, 7.25 inches on the open, 3 inches straight up on the working blade part. So very typical uh, for your outdoorsman or EDC knives. Not overly sized, so people won't want to carry it every day. The steel on this, we said, was magnet cut. So let's take a look at the steel chart. This is our edge retention chart over here. Magnet cut comes in right here as a nice five, which is pretty decent. I mean, you're not looking for something that's going to be uh, razor sharp 24-7 for two months. You want something that's going to be holding the edge as you're working outdoors. Where they come in better than other blades and other steel is their toughness here and their toughness you're going to see it jumps up to a seven really nice and even more so for the outdoorsman and for the hunter this is your stainless properties it's nine and nine point five out of ten so that's really where they're finding the toughness and the stainless properties is really where you we are it still is great edge retention but it really is focused on an outdoorsman's properties on, on the steel itself so that's it today for the Iona V2 from Giant Mouse. I hope this information was helpful. Before you go, please make sure you hit that like button and be sure to just subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any of our new content that comes out. Thanks for watching. You guys have a great day. We'll see you here next time.